Hey everyone, welcome to our second slide. We will teach you about how do you achieve goals in this industry uh, that is hard to become profitable. You should have a thick skin. We we'll always say it is vital to have a thick skin in this industry. So, firstly, what is a goal? It's very important to know what we are doing here. So, a goal is a process oriented pathway to achieve something in a specified period of time with self-discipline so there are three components with this definition we say a pathway that is got a direction that needs to be targeted with a specified period of time and also with self-discipline so every trader should have goals you can't say we're a trader without having goals right so we should have goals so that you become a bigger trader so what are the main goals to become a bigger trader at the end of the year we say we should follow a oriented process by reading books that are educative because we believe that students who are still in, in college who are trading by themselves as retail traders to grow their portfolio they need to read more books I was also one of the uh, people who used to read books. That's how I was introduced. I was introduced. Uh, I introduced myself to trading. Hence, we say seek alternative uh, wisdom. Have self, uh, have self discipline, right? Remember, in this course, be like a sponge to achieve this mind game, right? By trying to grasp all the concept do the data work we say do the data work we can't spoon feed you we've already given this information that is uh, to public that we think it costs a lot of money but we've decided to say students who are still in college they should know about this so that when they come in age funds or in our trading firm and apply they should have this kind of basics of information so we say ask if you don't know or you don't understand we'll provide links to our trading films we will get in touch with us we you need to ask about more about our course you have a thick skin by swimming in the life markets to gain some experience so we say practice 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 so becoming a bigger trader by the end of the year we say understand the complete foundation of this course by also have a solid understanding a solid understanding or a solid foundation by understanding all the concept read books that are mixed is either trading or general life educative books practice a demo account for about one to two to three weeks trade in the life markets by using manual trading we'll teach you about how to trade using uh softwares we'll give a course in the later stage uh of algorithmic trading we will teach you about meta course language for lane trading automation we will teach you about this as i have said earlier on lastly automate your trade your trading strategy by learning as students you don't want to sit 24 7 to a screen we say go to school in class so we always recommend students to learn about how to automate your trading strategy trade in the life markets by automation the bigger goal and then if they learn something you 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 do it take action you learn about how to automate your trading do it in life markets right lastly learn python 3 this language is becoming uh, a rise in the financial in industry so always recommend students to learn about python 3 so that when they come to our trading films when you hire these people they've got an age they know how to use this language it's very important it's used in many sectors nowadays so we say remember goals without an oriented map road map is like scrolling around a big jungle looking for an ice cream it's quite funny that you move around in a jungle looking for ice cream so we say that's why we say you should have a goal as a bigger to become a bigger trader to say at the end of the year i should now code i should do this that's the most important thing right so what is the road map to become a bigger trader or the road map to become successful in this industry so we say the first step is having uh, some trading basic knowledge right have a solid understanding of of basics right 
what you call the first level of entry of knowledge that requires you to go to the next step what you call advanced stuff right the second step to become a bigger trader is to learn advanced basics right learn about how do you do algorithmic trading now you know how to do manual so we say go to this stage where you learn about algorithmic trading where you use softwares to trade on your own to create robots this excel we highly recommend people to know it i think every each and everyone has learned this in your first year i've also learned this in my in my first day so i also recommend people to learn about excel and also metacos full language will give a course in later stage on how to trade using softwares in python 3 so the third step to success to become successful is you have a trade a uh, trading system or techniques right you should have strategies that will produce profits consistently very important terminology here right and also we say find mentors people who know what they are doing not to are prophesying they know something while they don't know anything not influencers we say find someone who is doing this professionally is their job right so the fourth step is to gain some trading experience right so we say perfect perfecting something it needs practice so improving it needs practice so we say practice practice right you don't need to reinvent a new wheel in the market to win to win every trade you don't need to have complicated uh, trading strategies to become profitable in this industry what you need to do is use simple trading strategies we've analyzed and say and we have discovered that most of the traders here at Unicosa Trading Group will become profitable in this chain they use simple strategies so the last step is use paper trading we don't recommend students to go to live markets before they use demo so we say use demo for about one to two weeks so that you gain some experience uh, experience this process should be intensively because you need to go to live market right so we say practice practice so that you go to life markets to have a skin in the game so we say learn until you become better right so remember when you start do not try to learn everything about trading at once we recommend people not to become overwhelmed by so much information patient is vital in this game because we believe this game is a mind game right so patience is very important start with the smallest position size or what you call portfolios right you don't need to dump all of your money in the market start with the smallest position so that you experience how the life markets behaves right this helps you to alleviate your anxiety when you are losing money in the markets right so the bottom line we say what is the bottom line we say pick a market that you are interested in right in trading set your, yourself up with the tools right you have picked the market that you're interested set yourself e equip yourself with the tools softwares knowledge and everything will give you everything in this course choose a time frame that you trade right if you want to become a day trader a swinger trader choose a time frame that you are comfortable right you don't know about you choose a time frame that you are comfortable typically around major market openings and closing we explain about this terminology don't worry for now focus on winning with one strategy before learning others we recommend people if you give you a strategy learn about that strategy before you learn others don't you overwhelm yourself with too much strategies so we say hands on your skill Practicing is the most important thing in this game.